the 2018 Mayesh Design Star. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to build an arch. Um, it's a series of simple steps and you can use whatever product that you like. Today I've been using a lot of product from Naniwa, which is this amazing Japanese grower. Today I'm going to be using some Spirea, ranunculus, butterfly ranunculus, eucalyptus, and acacia foliage. Also, I will be using roses. I started with foam, so I have cages of foam that are soaked in water and I've zip tied them to the arch, um, physically zip tied them to the archway so that they're stable and in place. And then I've also zip tied them in additional places, more than one place so that the cage won't fall or the foam won't fall out of the cage onto the ground. Um, and then I've also used some wire to wire some of the cages to the archway. Um, and I feel, as soon as everything feels sturdy, that's when I feel confident. And depending on what kind of product you're using, I'm using um, pretty light products, so I feel like I can uh, get away with not zip tying it maybe as much as I could if I was doing something a little bit fuller. Um, so after zip tie an oasis, then I'm gonna start with greenery, and I'm just gonna start by building a shape. I'm using the spirea in a way that its movement allows for shape all the way around. It's kind of giving me structure. And then I'm gonna fill in with other greenery. I'm gonna add um, roses on top. I'm gonna to add ranunculus on top of that. And I'm just kind of layer everything and make sure to add a lot of dimension um, so that when you see the archway all around, it looks beautiful from every, every side. A lot of fun doing this. Thanks so much for watching the video and I hope to see you guys out on tour.